So everybody, so does it matter which direction you swirl your wine? Absolutely. As a matter of fact, this phenomenon was first discovered by former chemistry professor turned master sommelier, Dr. Sid Finch. And it was documented by journalist George Plimpton way back in the Paris Review in 1985. You see, Dr. Finch was left-handed. He couldn't understand why he was always rating his wines significantly higher than his other peers when they were tasting wines in the Northern Hemisphere. But when they were in the Southern Hemisphere, the exact opposite effect was happening. He discovered that like me, most of his tasting partners were right-handed. When I swirl wine, the tendency is for me to swirl it going counterclockwise. You see, in the Northern Hemisphere, this is the same direction that toilets, drains, and hurricanes spin. But because Dr. Sid Finch was left-handed, he naturally swirled his wine clockwise. After his initial scientific discovery in 1985, there's been significant subsequent studies, and it was discovered that in fact, by swirling your wine in the opposite natural direction, that more flavors are released from this natural occurring friction. This explains why it is best to swirl your wine clockwise when you're in the Northern Hemisphere and counterclockwise when you're in the Southern Hemisphere. Cheers, everybody.